Now, should PA applicants take the MCAT, the GRE, or the new kid on the block, the PA CAT? Yes. Great question. So as I've mentioned, there are 300, I think a little over 300 accredited PA programs. Mm -hmm. The last that I knew of uh, just a few over 100 do not require the GRE. Do they not require any test or just they do not require the GRE? They do not require any test. Got it. Okay. That's a lot. That's about a third. That's right. So a third do not require any test. Most do not accept the MCAT. Okay. So there's usually no reason for PA students to be taking, embarking on the MCAT. And less than 20 schools at this point in time require the PA CAT. Okay. So uh, there is a list of schools out there that are requiring the PA CAT. I think we are going to see that number grow year to year to year. But right now we're under 20. But as that PA CAT, for those of you who might be new to this information, the PA CAT is a newer standardized test. It was beta tested maybe two years ago. And as we see it become more reliable and more um, data comes out about its validity, I believe we are going to see more PA schools accepting it as a standardized test and requiring it. 